your girl Nelly back again with another video. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to lay your lace front wig and make it look natural and slay honey, slay all day. Super easy, um, super affordable, nothing too hard or too complicated. And don't forget to subscribe you guys, hit that button down below. And I hope you guys appreciate this video and appreciate my insight. I'm not an expert, so don't come for me. This wig is only $28, it ain't made all that, okay? Don't come for me. I'm just trying to help y'all, okay? Okay, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Now the first thing that you wanna do is start off with your wig cap on. The next thing you wanna do is grab a wig of your choice. The wig that I'm using is the green cap lace front wig. It's literally just a cheap $28 wig from the beauty store. I was in desperate need of a wig and my mom went ahead and picked this up for me. Thank you mom, shout out to you, you're best. Cause without you, I feel like a real world. Huh. Okay, <laughs> I'm done. So um, a little bit about the wig has the cap, it has, um, I can secure it, hold on, let me show you guys, little secure thingy robbers, um, it says, it's, it's just a lace front, technically you see the lace right here, but it doesn't have, like, the part, literally the amount of lace that I'm working with, I can show you guys if I stand up, is this much lace, the rest is just track, so I'm literally working with this much lace, so this video is more for people who don't have a, this video is more for people who don't have a wig that already has that, you know, that part out where they could pluck and, you know, use concealer. So you want to start by just brushing the wig out. Then, of course, you want to secure the straps in the back. Once you've secured the straps in the back, you want to go ahead and put the wig on. This is one of the crucial steps to getting your wig perfect. So I'm going to zoom you guys in a little bit so you can see what I'm doing. So now that I got you guys all zoomed in, I'm going to put my thumb underneath the wig and pull it forward. You want to make sure that no hair is kind of tucked underneath here. You just want to pull it as forward as you can. As you can see, this is the lace right here. And I pretty much want the lace to be right where my hairline starts. So this is how I would look if I decide just to go out and wear the wig just like this, which I don't think it's bad, but for me, it just, it obviously looks like I'm wearing a wig and that's not the look we're going for right here, right now. This is not, but this is, this is not the tea, honey, all right? So what we go do is we're going to grab a tail comb, put this, push the wig back a little bit. Get this all this hair out of the way. So we're gonna push the wig back a little bit and then I'm gonna start pulling some hair out. Right there. Y'all know my edge is looking real rough right now, but you just wanna pull some of your hair out. <laughs> have that illusion out but of course it's not gonna like obviously this hair texture and this hair texture is not matching up so we're gonna go ahead and flat iron our edges hey, hey, why do I feel like I linger linger between the words to say hey, to say the words you remember now we're here to take control over your body and over your soul we're gonna take back Okay, so once you've gotten your hair flat iron, you definitely want to create some type of part that lines up with this, the lace. So I have this little tiny, it's so tiny you guys, you could barely see it. But I've created the illusion of a part right here. So once I've created that part, I want to go ahead and distribute the hair that I just flat ironed. Kind of take it up and brush it over like so. Brush it over. Just blend it into the hair. Now this, from afar, it could look somewhat real, okay? But up close, once it focuses, you'll be able to see the difference in the hair texture. So what I'm going to do next is I'm going to take um, some Gorilla Snot right here, and I'm going to use that just to gel my hair down. Lose it all, 
this part of my hair down I'm gonna go ahead and take a brush this is just an edge brush and brush my hair up into the wig so once you've gone ahead and you've gelled down your hair and brush it over into your wig. I'm gonna go ahead and brush the wig out and let it lay how you want to. So once you've gone ahead and you've blended that, you can go ahead and use some edge control just to give it a little swoop swoop action going. So that's what we're gonna do. Let's get a little swoop swoop in. Let me get my mirror. <laughs> The next thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to take this scarf and tie it around the base, the edges right here. Just tie it down. So get the hair all out of your face and tie the hair down. Voila, you just want to let this sit for a little bit and then you'll be good, okay? Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope y'all appreciate this look. It's a look. It's a look. It's a <laughs> Nothing makes you feel confident, more confident knowing that you're slaying your wig and you're getting your edges right and you'll get a little bit glow going on. That, that it just, it does it for me, all right? So, I hope you guys enjoyed. Once again, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and peace out.